So, but the habits you develop, and, and, and I go back, the other thing is have the right heroes. I mean, I, I've always been lucky in that respect. And it, if, the, you know, if, if you, the people you look up to are going to form your vision of what the world, you know, how you want to be in later life. And the one, well, I'll give you two pieces of advice. I'd invest as much in myself as you can. I mean, you're, you're your own biggest asset by far. I mean, you've got, you've got all kinds of potential, all the people in this room, you, you know, you're lucky to be in this country, gotten a good education, but most people go through life using up a very, very small part of their potential. And so anything you do that invests in yourself, uh, is that's the best investment you can possibly make. And then I would, I would follow my passion. I mean, whatever turns you on, you know, I, uh, uh, I found, I was lucky, I found something early that, that turned me on, but, but uh, you don't want to take a job just for the money, you don't want to take a job for an organization that you really don't feel good about or work for people that you don't feel good about. You, you really want to be excited when you get out of bed every morning, and it won't necessarily be the job that you have 10 years later, but you'll be learning so much as you go along, and you know, I, I took a job with Ben Graham, my hero, and, and it you know, I, I never asked the salary, and I found at the end of the month when I got my first paycheck what I was earning because I just knew it was the right thing to be, to be doing.